Hey guys, Skinny Pigs one here. Today we're going to do some cage tours of everyone's cage. So five cages. So first off we have Barnaby here. He is on the top of the stack grids. He is in a 2 by 3 There he is right there eating his pepper this morning. Barnaby is now on Medicam, which is a pain reliever. Low dose once a day, every day. He has arthritis in his back and his lower hips, so he needs that in order to feel good. He had it for 10 days, and then after the 10 days, it was took a couple days, and then he was right back to being in pain again and not wanting to eat or drink much and looked uncomfortable. So now he is on that every day. But it's much better to have him on the pain meds and take any risks that that could have and have him enjoy his life. He's going to be four really soon, so we'll have to do a little party. So anyway, in Barnaby's cage, he has, this is from the Piggy Pop Shop. It was in my haul video just the other day. This is one of the Snuggums that was made extra large. And then there is the hay bag from Piggy Pop Shop. And under here, I have a 2x2 two two liner that I folded up just to give him some more padding while he's standing over here eating hay. And he has a small water bottle little piece of corner fleece just just for a little hide and another water bottle he has a cuddle cup here with a pad in it and another water bottle and his little food dish is over there and he has plexiglass on the front because once I moved him up here he liked to chew the bars while it was veggie time to tell me to hurry up Put a piece of plex, I mean a piece of coroplast here because once it was on there it took him a while but then he realized he could still chew a bit over in this corner with those smarty pants. Hey. And he has coroplast, or not coroplast, plexiglass over here so that him and Grover don't touch noses or chew bars. So that is little bee's cage. Now over here is Grover. He is eating out of his pellet dish. And this is his water bottle. And he has a hay bag from Piggy Pop Shop. And there is a pad under there to collect any pee and poops. He has a cozy cabby cave. And a cuddle cup from Piggy Pop Shop. And this was from Cobb Cabin Crafts a long time ago. Just to give him some shelter. And there's little Grover. My tiniest pig. Now down here is Kelvin. He's at the pellet dish. And Hobbs is over by the veggies. They have one of those corn rattle rollers and a little Woody's Christmas tree. That's from the Cozy Cabby, Piggy Pop Shop, and Piggy Bed Spreads. And now just so that there's no drafts from the vents ever, they have fleece around here and there's a water bottle a water bottle and their hay rack type thing and they also got extra padding right here for pee and poop collection and they have grids that block them from Ernie and there's plexiglass so again that nobody chews I'm going to be getting a hay bag for these guys instead so it's closer to their height to eat and over here is Ernie He's got his little food dish and his water bottle. He's got a cuddle cup that's looking a little rough. <laughs> and a cozy cave. He's got his hay bag with again an extra mat to collect extra pee and poops. He has a little Woody's Chew snowman sitting by his foot there. Not sure if he's used it yet. Now over here is the Bun Bun. He is in a 2x5 with the custom made base. He has some fiddlesticks there. A little carpet. Let's get The carpet looks a bit stained just because he eats his lettuce up there so it's just lettuce juice. Then he has a little kebab and this is his absolute favorite spot to sit. And then under there are some grass mats for him just for something to do. He has his little food dish that I customized. Oh, hello. A little itch. And then he's got a rattle roller, a carrot, 
the little pre present from the Woody's Chew, the little jingly bell, little heart toss, corn rattle roller, some more mats, and then he has a little carrot food dish for pellets, the carrot dish for his water, and the hay box I got from Etsy, which I absolutely love, and his extra large jumbo cat litter pan with aspen shavings. And it just holds to the side with some clips. So that's Seymour's cage. He's only in here at night. Well, he's right here right now because I'm going to let him out as soon as I'm done this video. He is out during the day for at least 12 hours a day. Baby, is it time to come out soon? Like, I just have to set it all up. It's a mess right now. But these grids go all the way across and tuck in behind there. And then he has all over to run. And like his cage door swings all the way open. So he can go in his cage and run on the floor. And all those toys I just have stacked in the corner here that I got to set out for him. So I better get doing that or he'll be sad. So that is the piggy room. Piggy and bunny room I should say. Alright, see you guys.